Max Verstappen is now a two-time world champion, but success in 2022 was far more straightforward than the previous season. Max Verstappen has explained the worst kind of feeling he had in 2021 when he and Lewis Hamilton were engaged in an epic battle for the title. The championship went down to a gripping finale in Abu Dhabi, with Hamilton winning in Brazil, Qatar and Saudi Arabia to overturn a 21-point deficit to ensure the pair were level in the standings for the the final race. And at the Yas Marina, it was the Mercedes man who seemed to be heading for a comfortable win before a crash for Williams driver Nicholas Latifi caused chaos. In the now infamous safety car saga that followed, Verstappen was ultimately gifted the chance to overtake his rival on the final lap and take the checkered flag. There was no such drama in 2022, with Verstappen cruising to the title whilst Hamilton struggled with his new W13 car. The Dutchman finished a huge 146 points clear in the standings, racking up a record-breaking 15 Grand Prix victories in the process, and whilst there were numerous flashpoints between the pair the previous campaign, it was a different story this time around. The only controversy took place in Brazil, where the two collided on the track with Verstappen given a time penalty for the incident. And now the Red Bull man has admitted how different things were in 2022 compared to his first title success, saying, all the way to the last race was probably the worst kind of feeling. At the time I didn't think we were the quickest anymore, so that also doesn't help. And this year, it has just been very, very different in emotions, from the start, all the way through the year. Indeed, Verstappen's issues this time around had little to do with the driver's standings. He was involved in a spat with teammate Sergio Perez, refusing to let his partner through in Sao Paulo despite team orders to give up his place to the Mexican, and the validity of his two title wins were also questioned by critics and rival teams after it emerged Red Bull had broken the budget cap in 2021. Despite Christian Horner initially denying the allegations, they were found to have overspent by £1.8 million. As a result, the team were fined £6 million and given a reduction in allocated wind tunnel time next year. Many F1 fans have argued the punishment is lenient, and Horner and co. declined to appeal the sanctions.